Wow, nice. Two legs. Okay. Oh, so pretty. Why is it cute? How to be like her? Oh my god! He's so handsome. I'm melting. Hi. Welcome to typical monologue of daily social media scrolling. I'm Melissa Farhana and I'm going to share about social media might be hurting your mental health. A study shown that we spend average 2 hours on social media every day and this involves on people around us. Let me tell you that. There is four stresses of social media these days. One, the highlight reels. Social media is where we highlight ourselves, where we show our best and proudest moments. Not to realize that we are constantly comparing ourselves with others. And that will lead to insecurities. Stress number two is social currency in Malaysia our currency is ringgit Malaysia but in social media the currency is like the comment the share we give to that particular post the more the likes of the picture the more value it is worth sharing worth looking that makes it become viral but the problem is in our social media we are the product have you ever experienced that we taken down photo because it didn't get as much like as we expected well i've done i've done that too size or not we just let other people define our value which is quite positive right stress number three is fear of missing out formal FOMO is a actual social anxiety that we might be left out because we didn't follow current trends. We uh, make us question our self worth, our maybe safety as well. So the stress number four is on harassment, which is study shown that almost. 40% of netizens have once, at least once, uh, experienced an online, online harassment. Meanwhile, uh, about 70% have been witness online harassment. Most of it happens to the community of LGBT, um, black people, Muslims, families, and any others as well actually can lead to other serious diseases like uh, mental, is mental illness which is anxiety, stress and depression <laughs> influence you to deactivate it and stay away from your social media accounts but I encourage you to practice a social media wellness which is we filtering the things that we want to follow on our social media we limiting our time to socialize on the social media we don't expose it ourselves too much on it just don't get too attached to social media is because it's not about the social media social media will uh, be exist uh, whether now and 10 years in future like 100 years in future they will still exist but not us so we just live here so live your life and I hope you learn something 
Thank you.